Welcome to London Yard. I'm just getting into my room. Guys, I am exhausted. I cannot wait to lay down. So I'll see you after my nap. <sighs> I am just waking up from a five hour nap. We got in this morning at uh, 7.30 uh, and I got to the hotel at about 9 o'clock and yeah, right now it is 2 p.m. here in London and I'm just waking up from a much needed nap. It was a long flight. I was exhausted. Um, so yeah, nap felt really good. Excuse me. Whoa. Okay. Time for some instant coffee, some good old Nescafe, living the life. And uh, yeah, so this is my favorite shortbread cookies in the entire world. And you take shortbread and you put chocolate. I mean, you got me, you got me all to yourself, man. I mean, these are my favorite cookies in the entire world. I love these uh, shortbread cookies at this hotel. No smoking, but I'm so hot I'm smoking. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to London. I'm walking over to uh, Oxford Street right now. Uh, gonna just look at some of the stores and uh, see what I can find here at London. I'm not big of a shopper, but uh, every now and again, I don't mind finding a, uh, a good deal. So I'm gonna check out some of the stores on Oxford Street and see if I can show you guys what it's like being in London. Uh, back in Canada, it's like minus 25 degrees right now. That's in Celsius, uh, so it's fairly cold. Uh, but in London, a bit of an overcast, a little bit of rain, and it's uh, 10 degrees. So not too bad, not too shabby. So I'm at uh, Marks and Spencer here right now in London. This place honestly uh, brings back such nostalgia because I remember being a little boy. My sister, she was a flight attendant and she would come to London and then she would always bring stuff back from Marks and Spencer. So this place will always have a um, special spot in my heart. You guys look at how cheap all this stuff is. Buck 80 for a t-shirt. Not bad. Used to be two pounds, but now it's dollar. Well not dollar eighty, it's pound eighty for a t-shirt. But I don't think I like any of them, but it's still a pretty good bargain. Look, I found this really awesome shades. I got four pairs. I'm going to Cancun in a few days, so these will come real handy and I cannot wait to wear them. I feel like after all that walking and shopping, I've definitely earned this, uh, this bottle of wine. Well, mind you, I'm not gonna have the entire bottle, maybe a couple of glasses, but uh, right now I'm gonna go ahead and get this baby open. This is the old fashioned 
um, wine opener that I got from the, uh, the bar downstairs. Uh, I'm not sure how to use it to be quite honest. Um, I know the other one that kind of sticks on top here and then it helps you take the cork out. That's a lot easier but this is like the old-fashioned that the, uh, the real bartenders use. So let's see if I can make that happen. Ooh, a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. And I'm wearing all white, so I'm glad that there was no spills. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and have a couple of glasses right now. Unfortunately, I do not have any wine glasses in the room. And when I went downstairs to get the, the wine opener, I totally forgot to get wine glasses. So I'm gonna have to use these guys. But it doesn't matter because it's still gonna taste exactly the same. Ooh, maybe a little bit more. Is this good enough? Cheers, guys. Mmm, smells so good. I love the cabin stuff now. So good. Mm-hmm. 